So finally I decided to test Cyberpunk. And it was just in time for Overdrive patch, which is path tracing. So I will do in three parts. The first one is going to be path tracing only in different scenarios and settings. The second one is going to be the original ray tracing option. And the third one is going to be just the gameplay with optimized settings. And currently I'm running you general settings that I'm going to use unless specified otherwise. So as you can see the path tracing is way too intensive even for 1390, especially at native resolution. Now for original ray tracing I decided to use 4 presets of DLSS for Psycho ray tracing setting and the fit benchmark is for optimized settings. So for the last part I decided to add a little bit of gameplay with optimized settings and as you can see this is one of the most demanding areas in the game, especially from CPU. So it seems like it's gotten even harder to run over the time. I think in the first year I could play it with max settings in balanced DLSS at around 60 FPS but over the time it got harder and harder to run so i am aware that it got few updates in retracing but for the most part it's actually harder to run than it was at launch and i'm not even talking about path tracing but for original ray tracing so yeah it seems like 1390 is not enough for cyberpunk I'm not even talking about path tracing, but even just the uh, original ray tracing. And DLSS is basically mandatory if you want to play it at 4K and max basic settings. So anyways, I'll leave you with the gameplay. As always, thank you very much for watching and see you next time.